now as we approach fall, it's a good time to begin thinking about next spring and establishing your milkweed plantings to benefit the monarch butterfly. Begin prepping this, the ground by removing uh, some of the vegetation. The one thing to make sure of is that all the monarch larvae have completed their life cycle on the milkweed, typically after early October, and then next spring you'll have a, your location prepared to begin planting your transplants or your root sections. After a, a year or so, uh, when the milkweed plants become fully established, you'll start noticing active seed pods being produced. The pods will be turning a little brown when they are mature, so it has to go through a period of stratification. One way to do that is to uh, remove the seed, place it in a nylon mesh bag, and simply bury it in the ground. And the next spring, you can remove it, and that seed would have been exposed to the natural environmental conditions uh, that help to increase germination. Another way you might consider uh, stratifying your seed is using your home refrigerator. Place them in a damp paper towel, uh, in a Ziploc bag, in your refrigerator. And after four to six weeks, uh, you're ready to remove them and place them in soil for germination. At BSF, we will be continuing our research efforts and uh, help educate farmers on how they can increase their on-farm biodiversity without jeopardizing their crop production. For more information on Living Acres, uh, you can go to our website at living-acres.basf.us. BASF. We create chemistry.